Ruth here, and I have a few late Christmas things that have arrived. So, I guess first up, we'll do this. Um, it's from... Well, it says inside. It's a very nice, uh... Christmas stamp. Anyway, uh, yeah. It's a bit... Blurred, but I'll put the, the picture, you know, at the end. This is their, their card. Happy holidays and hope you have an amazing new year. And it's from Rico Rocket 101 from Instagram. Or on Facebook, it's Rico Paints. Or on Etsy, it's Anime Shark. So that's their card. Then they added a couple things inside, a couple goodies inside. Oh, first of all, the the website is uh, pearltcg.ca. It has loads of Pokemon and um, Dragon Ball, uh, and some Naruto on there as well. So, um, first of all, this is from Miss Yupaku, and this is from John King Fuji. So, we'll finish off this one. So, we've got a very lovely Haku uh, sticker. Let me move this out of for a sec. Then we have this card. It's, uh, from No Game No Life. This one is from Batman Ninja. And yeah, they're uh, vice words. This very shiny holographic one is a uh, Dragon Ball Super. This one, that's another shiny one. It is from Digimon. That's a very cool back on that one. And this one obviously is Pokemon. And this one is Universe. And the battery ran out so I don't know if uh, there's more detail. But um, I don't know if it cut me off. This is uh, My Hero Academia as the Universe or the Universe uh, versus, versus yeah, it says it right there. That's pretty cool backing, though. But anyway, so that's that's those stuff from Rico. So do go check them out. So oh, there's that. Loads of stuff for sale. Put his card over here. I'll just put them there for now. So next up, this is from. Supaku, Miss Supaku on Instagram. It's so cute. Oh, did you look at that? It's got a lot of hair. And is he so cute? And it is Sebastian Mikhailis from Black Butler. This is a uh, Nendroid Plus plushie. That's cool. I actually don't have any of this kind of brand plushie. So, that's cool. Cool, cool. Thank you so much. Yes, obviously. Thank you, Rico Rocket 101, for lovely cards and sticker and thank you Miss Yupaku do go check out her Instagram as well she's lovely and has very 
um, nice uh, posts. Lots of different. Um, well, the layout of the, the pictures are very nice, shall we say? Tongue tied here. Anyway. So that's that. Um, this is from my sister. It um, came recently in the post. It's very cute. Luna keychain. Not sure where I'll put it. Made in China. Hmm. But anyway, I'll probably put it with my other bone straps on the corkboard or something. But yeah, that's that. And um, let's see. That's those things. Uh -huh. So, now put these off to the side. So I get some space for this. So there's a bell in there somewhere. Uh, anyway, she put some Final Fantasy washi tape on it. So that's cute. Um, I just put it in here. My washi tape scrapbook. Just need to find a good place to put it. Because, like, for instance, one of the previous washi tapes that she stuck on one of the packages was uh, this Final Fantasy one. The Chocobo one. That was a cute one. And like, I'm getting distracted, but anyway. Another one that she stuck on. One of the other packages. If I can find it. Was this cute. Huh. This cute, I think, really cool one, and the sugary fruits basket one. Um, there's also another fruits basket one that she put on as well. It was the uh, Hatsuharu, I think. If I can find it somewhere. if she has the other Zodiac ones as well. That'd be cool. But anyway, I shall stick this in. You know, I really do have to pl finish playing with Final Fantasy X. Two and two. Anyway, there you go. There it is. Okay, now that I'm Sufficiently finished being distracted by washi tape. Let's get on with opening this thing, shall we? I'm excited to see what it is. How do I start opening it? I need some scissors for this. And obviously she had the washi tape on the front, but obviously my address is on the front, so I'm not showing you that. Ooh. So gotten in for
very thick tape. That's why I mean, it's not thick tape. There's a lot of tape. A lot of tape. Okay. Uh huh. Super cute. Let's hold the camera out here so you can see. Merry Christmas with the best wishes for Merry Christmas. And there's in this cute up top here. She she got a little that's what the bell is. Little Sylveon Bell, that's cute. So cute. I'm gonna need to take a picture of him. So I can. Because I think last time I forgot, or one of the times I forgot to take a picture and I took off the bow and I couldn't really tie it back. <laughs> so I'll be right back. Okay, so. First little gift is this little Sylveon doll. That's so cute. I'm tempted to stick it up, you know. Up there, but uh, I don't know. I won't be able to actually get hold of it. So I'm gonna stick on my work board with the rest of my keeping things. But this is, I guess, a phone strap thing. Nice. The camera over there. Yeah, undo. get distracted by doing that. So I'm just gonna pop it off to the side <laughs> so I don't constantly bring it because like I'd probably do that. Find me. Okay, so Christmas bag, I still have the uh, Christmas bag from last year. It was a very pretty red and sparkly gold like fabric kind of bag. This is cute too. So I can keep it with the, the last year's one. I'm just like that. <laughs> so just put that over there for now. Oh, you know what? I'll just place it down here, shall I? Just for some festive, festive background here. There. Not that you can see anything, can you? But anyway, we'll move slowly on over here. So you can see it in the camera and not really, but you see a pink blob thing. Okay, so, got a little note. Isn't that cute? It's got a little soccer sticker. You do really have lovely handwriting. Let's see. Merry Christmas. Sorry for the light. Uh, been very busy for these past weeks and finally able to take some breather. Hmm. Stopped on a few Japanese goodies. Hope you like them, especially the ramen. Ooh, enjoy that. Enjoy the goodies and have a great week ahead and happy 2022. <laughs> That's cute. It says the season when rabbits are excited. That's a cute little stationary thing. Like this little little rabbit there. Hmm. That's cute. 
So I'll stick this in my scrapbook with my Christmas card note stuff. So I'll just place that right there. Ooh. I wonder what this stuff is. From the top of it. Oh, it is. Crispy noodle snacks. They're basically dried ramen thingies. So that's cool. Oh, what are these things? They have seasoning for rice. I think I remember that from last year. Next up. Ooh. It's a made in Japan. Miso flavor. Non fried noodle. That's cool. I don't think I've had these before. And I've got these. Fruit granola. Maple syrup. Oh, I remember these from last time. These are really good. I shared it with the. Uh, Mom last time. I might just just keep it all for myself this time. <laughs> the next oh, we got um are they like jelly bean things? Fruity jelly bean kind of things. That's cute. Can't read a single thing of what flavor it is, but we shall see when I stick it in my mouth. So next. Ooh, we've got tonkatsu, which is uh, beef flavor. Mmm, that's really good. And next up, we got. Ooh, I love these. I think it's a different, is it a different brand? I don't know, it's the same brand. I think I used to say Royal something on top. Anyway, milk cookies. I love it. I remember them. I think I... Yeah. I think I made a passing comment to ask her to include it for next year. <laughs> At least this year. Anyway, um, okay, so this is... What is this? Are they coasters? I don't know. Kind of reminds me of a cork coaster kind of thing. That's cute. It looks like a cork. I think it's a coaster. Like two coasters. Okay. Kind of like pops out. That's cute. What's this? Nintendo TPC Pikachu Living and Dining Core? It's, it's missing K, but uh, I'm guessing it's a cork uh, coaster. That's my guess, anyway. Oh, that's cool. It's there. And then, lastly... Ooh. Oh, that's so cute! Is a, uh... What do you call them? A... Well, I have no clue what the word is. It's all in Japanese. So it's um, it's from a Kuji, and it's the uh, I Prize, and it's uh, I'm gonna go with poster. I'm gonna put it out here. A cute Rimuru eating. That is one of his festival things. 
That's cute. Hang on. Let me open it. A harvest festival. Yeah, this is a uh, very thick cardboard like poster thing. There you go. That's what it says. It's not cute. It's a little hamster cheeks. And we got the Harvest Festival from the anime. That time I got reincarnated as a slime. They really do make long titles these days. They are. That's so cute. It's got a little remove face, like his slime form as a uh, candied um, apple, maybe. But anyway, yeah. That's so cute. You know, I actually don't think I have any Rimuru posters. Not sure where I'll put it. But I'll think of something. I'll probably leave it in the, the plastic, though. Then stick it up so I don't ruin the back or anything. Stick it in here so I can take my pictures properly. Well, if it wants to go back in, and then you can put that. against Kirito over there. There we go. That's, that's a little, a little snack. <laughs> Look at all them goodies. Thank you so much for sending these. I love them. Which is good because I didn't feel like eating chicken for dinner tonight. So I'll munch on something. Something. You know, the, these these won't last long. I mean, like I can eat like three or at least half the box in one sitting. I probably shouldn't, but I probably will anyway. So that is everything. And I have just enough room in my tiny section <laughs> of my desk. I really need to put things away and reorganize things really. But yeah. It's great. I don't think I've ever tasted these two before, so it's going to be good. I can't wait to see what actually the other stuff is inside it too. Got some squishy bits or something in there. But anyway, yes, that's. I'm not sure what else to say, really. But yeah, that, that's everything. Should I name this what I got for Christmas part two? <laughs> A bit late in the month, but uh, yeah. I don't think there's anything else coming. I'm pretty sure there's not. Um, oh, from my other friend that gave me a 20 
£5 Amazon gift voucher. I am using that towards the uh, pre-order for the new Pokemon uh, Legend of Arceus game. Of course, it's very counterproductive pre-ordering the game before I get a Switch. But it's... yeah. Not, not really the way you're supposed to do it. You're supposed to buy the console and buy the game. Normally, you know. But yeah. I pre-ordered it. <laughs> yeah. I really need to order the other Pokemon Switch games, though, too. I'm very behind. But yeah. So that's what I planned for, for the thing. Since I'm ordering one for my friend. She liked the uh, the freebies on the the UK version than her than her version, which when she told me what her freebie was, it was a bit of a it was a bit of a letdown I think. So like in the the UK freebie, you get a Pokeball game cartridge case thing, and was it something else too? Well, there were two freebies or something. But anyway, yeah. So I'm more or not for her. For when it arrives next week or the week after. Then I'll be shipping it back over to her when it comes. But anyway. I am so going off on a tangent, aren't I? But yes, that's everything. You know, I said that like a five times? Three, five times? I'm just gonna go now. So, fun. Thank you so much for, for the plushie, for the interesting set of different cards there. Cause like, I don't collect really much of any of them apart from the Pokemon one and the Vice Farts, but only for the anime that I actually like. Or remember to actually buy any. I haven't bought any Vice Farts in years. So I just add those, you know, to my uh, miscellaneous card section in one of my binders. But yes, that's, that's everything. Anyone can never have too many coasters. But I don't know if I'd want to use them, you know. I'd probably, I don't know, leave it in the packaging and just stick it somewhere. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, thank you so, so much for the lovely goodies. It's very kind of you. And they're not going to last long, right? Trust me on that. <laughs> so thank you for watching. I can for more. Ring that over for notifications. Over and out.